Time for some news, some premium black news, some premium black. <laughs> nah, that's that star's punchline. That's DJ star's punchline. Star terrain's punchline. But we have this news report. This is a live reading for me. Um, so this is a genuine reaction, a real time reaction. So right here, updates, shade room updates. <laughs> like I said, premium black news. Darius Dalton Jackson reportedly denies abuse claims after Kiki Palmer is granted a temporary restraining order. Okay. So Kiki Palmer's ex denies the abuse allegations, obviously. So last week, we're reading from this caption here to the right via the Shade Room staff. Oh, Lord. So last week, Kiki Palmer was granted a temporary restraining order against her ex and the father of her son, Darius Dalton Jackson, after he was accused of abusing her multiple times. Now Darius is reportedly denying the allegations. Now, I'm going to make a pause here. It's not it's very it's very common for the abuse claims to be put in place to be used as a weapon to uh, separate a father from his child in the United States. I'm not saying what she's saying is wrong or, or is true or false, but just I'm just putting that out there. It is not uncommon for a woman to claim abuse and abuse could constitute. They could talk about financial abuse, emotional abuse, verbal abuse. So they expand that definition so they can use it against you in the court, uh, in the court of law, in the court of public opinion. OK, back to the reading. According to TMZ TV, a source close to Darius reportedly claims that the latest issue between the two stemmed from a disagreement about the custody of their son, Leotis. Again, very common. <laughs> the source shared that Darius and Kiki were texting about him picking up their son to watch a football game last Sunday. However, when he arrived at Kiki's place, their son wasn't there, leading to an argument. Kiki called her mother and her mother allegedly threatened to put a bullet in Darius' head. Okay. Now, that move, that's also very common amongst, you know, custody exchanges. Um, mothers do a lot of, you know, estranged mothers do a lot of weird things during custody exchanges. So, whether court-ordered or not court-ordered. So, that's, this is me reading this live, though. So, I'm just, I'm just giving a genuine reaction. So, back to the report a source connected to kiki reportedly told the outlet that darius began to cuss at kiki while she was on the phone with her mother and kiki's mother sharon threatened darius because she feared feared for her daughter's safety darius denies abusing kiki and the source connected to him claims the steel images attached to kiki's restraining order filing is from when darius tried to wrestle kiki's phone from her yo so remember causing them to tussle on the couch so anybody that Anybody that watched my other video on this when the reports just came out and they showed the steel images like the first images from 2022 when it showed him basically uh, him over him, her like hugging her basically around the stairs and they were just saying that they were fighting. And I, I remember seeing that comment and I pointed it out. I said, look, the comment said it looks like they're wrestling for a phone. <laughs> I was like, that's what I, I'm like. That's what I thought, too. I'm like, I'm literally I'm like, it looks like they're wrestling from a phone. Don't ask me how I know uh, <laughs> how I know, like these moves and stuff. I'm looking at the, the steel images. That first one from 2022, that one that she kept on on lock, that one, it literally looked like they were uh, she, she was wrestling. <laughs> they were wrestling for her phone. So now it's confirmed <laughs> And the source connected to him claims the steel images attached to Kiki's restraining order filing is from when Darius tried to wrestle Kiki's phone from her, causing them to tussle on the couch. The source claims the police were called over, but didn't find any probable cause to arrest Darius for domestic violence. Yeah, this is very common. This is very common. This is very common. Where a, cu a couple just be arguing mad loud. Police is called, whether it be by the next door neighbors or her or him. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Or by the parents that are just straight that, that are coming straight from the phone call. Wow. So it looks like everything I said in that first video, it's and she's just using that as he was abusive. I, I knew it. I knew it. Hmm. Interesting. The source claims the police were called over, but they find any problem with calls arrest series for domestic violence. And they did not make a report. The outlet also noted that in Kiki's restraining order filing. She also attached screenshots from an altercation that happened last year in February. However, it is unclear what led to that incident. Oh, that was probably the same thing. They saying that's from the. I don't know if they're mixing up the pictures, but if that's true, that means the other image is the same thing. Probably wrestling over a damn phone. 
<laughs> Hold up for a second, dog. Let me. I need. Let me give my <laughs> self a space just to laugh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that means they was wrestling over a phone again in the other image. If that's true, I think they're, she, she's mixing up the pictures, or I'm mixing it up. But if I'm mixing it up, that means they were wrestling over a phone again. <laughs> Oh, that means it's confirmed. It was just, that, this is some childish stuff. By the way, what people don't understand, that's always a lose-lose situation for the man. Like, or a woman will put themselves in a position where a man will try to leave, and then a woman will be like, no, you got to go through me. You got to go through me. Like, I've, I've seen women do this. So that's, this is very common. <laughs> this is very common. Couples wrestling over their damn phones. I'm talking about from man's phone and woman's phone, but both. When you hear that uh, story from Claudia Jordan, <laughs> oh, let me let me bring this up. Let me bring this up. Remember when Claudia Jordan uh 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 glitched and she turned full feminist and she's like, you know what? I'm not protecting black men anymore. You know what? Uh because when I <laughs> was dating this guy and he slammed me on the toilet and you know what? I'm just you know what? fuck you black man. <laughs> she well she didn't say fuck you black man, but she was basically saying, I'm tired of protecting you guys, quote unquote. And she's talked about because of her story what she went through with that guy. I think his name was Medina Islam or something. If I'm not mistaken, it was something Islam, not Rizzo Islam. Let's not disrespect that, brother. I'm talking about his name was like Medina Islam or something like that. And when she told when she said the story, I already know what it was. She said when she she basically got the guy's phone. Right. By the way, the guy was broke when she met her, when she met him. But she found him very attractive. So she wanted to take care of him. So <laughs> and, or, and whatever else he brought to the table. But he was broke. She found that guy's phone. She said she found that guy's phone. And when he found out, he, I guess, he beat her up so bad. She said she got her head slammed on the crack of, like, the toilet, uh, on the toilet. She got her head cracked on the toilet. And I'm like, damn, that's a violent response. Now, I was, and, and once, I, once I saw that, I was like, okay. If he, if a man has that kind of reaction for you taking his phone, I said, it's got to be only like one or three options. I, li I listed out the options. I said, look, it's either A, he's cheating on you. Well, obviously, men, uh, guys like that, because uh, because at first, because this, I didn't even know what he looked like. So I was just like, OK, who is this guy? And by the way, so I listed up the the, 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 the reasons I was like, so she's probably he's probably cheating on her with a rel one of your relatives or something. But even then, that wouldn't cause that reaction. So now, number two, that means he's. Uh, it's not even about you. It's, it's about who he's cheating with. So number two, he's cheating with his own relative or like a sister or something crazy sick or something like that. Or number three, he's cheating on <laughs> you with a man. That's the only three reasons for him to have such a violent reaction for you taking his phone because it should not be because I'm like, if it's just I'm like, I, I'm, I'm, I don't even think it's a best for cheating, cheating on her with a best friend. I don't even think it would garner that kind of reaction. That means so it's really just those two reasons. Either he's cheating on you with like one of his relatives, like something sick like that, or he's cheating on her with a man. That's the only two. And then lo and behold, I do research on Claudia Jordan's husband. You know, what? let me pull him up. This is what happened when I pulled up. Well, not that wasn't her husband, her boyfriend at the time. Let me <laughs> let me let me let me show you something real quick. Let me show you something real quick. <laughs> this is messed up, by the way. But let me show you all something. man. Let me show you all something. If I have time, I do. I end up doing research on Claudia Jordan's husband or sorry boyfriend what's that guy's name it was like something Islam so when I first saw Islam's uh, Medina is I was right I was right Medina Islam so right here <laughs> hold on for a second hold on for a second I'm about to show you guys so right here did it go through it better I went through yeah it went through so I, this is the first image I saw of Medina Islam. And I looked at him. I'm like, this guy's gay. <laughs> Yo, I saw this. I'm like, you picked up one of those dudes that was very attractive looking. But this guy, is, he's he's or he's in the closet. This guy. And they met. In, and I was like, oh, and they met in Atlanta. Bruh, this, I'm looking. I'm just looking just off pure looks. I'm looking at this guy. I'm like, this guy looks like a gay man. I'm sorry. <laughs> and they're right here. Look at this image right here. This is the guy in the middle. This is one of the first two images I saw of Medina Islam. And I'm like, this is a gay man. 
<laughs> this is what he was trying to hide. <laughs> he was probably trying to mess with Claudio Jordan and then move his way up in the industry by sleeping with the male executives. <laughs> I was li- I was like, oh my god! And now you're talking. Now you bring this all uh, all black men, and now you ain't protecting black men no more. When you're 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 dating a guy who's clearly gay. He's clearly gay. <laughs> And I don't want to I don't want to show like interviews of him because the interviews just seal the deal for me. But <laughs> it's like it's literally like, you know, <laughs> that's just me going off on a tangent right there. But back to Kiki, back to Kiki. Um, Look, man. This is childish. This is childish. Um, Let that man see his son. Stop. It's clear what you did to that man. You you sperm jack that man. You used him for his genetics. Kiki Palmer, I'm talking to you. You used that man for his genetics. And he, Darius, is finally realizing that uncomfortable reality that he was just being used for his genetics. And this is why he is reacting emotionally. Now, those two still images, and she they're already saying one of them was them wrestling on with the phone. That means both of them, those images, the one where he's over her on the couch. That means even that, that means this is still over the same BS. And obviously, she was monkey branching on him, probably cheating on him. But now he's become too much of a liability to Kiki Palmer. And Kiki Palmer wants to move on. So she is trying to excommunicate him. And not only excommunicate him, excommunicate him from seeing his own son. So this is clearly what the situation is. I'm not going to read the comment section of this because I feel like the comment section is is going to just make me mad because it's full of normies um <laughs> like low desired demographic of women going to be arguing for kiki palmer but we anybody that's now looking at this and now we're looking at the text between the mothers now i know what's going on it's pretty obvious from 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 <laughs> from here from this point on 